Hey guys, what's up? Just finished a long day of riding. We hung out in Narragansett Bay, Hope Island. And uh, I figured it'd be a good time to show you the uh, after ride care routine. And I also just grabbed a new PWC care kit from Salty Captain. So let me show you what I got real quick. I got the musket. This thing, I haven't used it yet, obviously. It's still in the box, but it's pretty sick. You can wash your ski with it and flush it out. I got some Final Touch Ceramic Spray to keep the plastic nice and shining. We got the outboard and PVWC engine flush to flush out your ski. I only ride in salt water, so you gotta do that, it's mandatory. We have the wash, a salt wash detergent specifically for salt water. Um, you know, I keep mine at the marina. It's constantly in salt water, around salt water, so this stuff should be useful. We also have a captain seal, it's for metal, metal pots. I probably won't use this too much, I don't think I have too much metal on the jet ski, but we have that. And we also have a chamois. So we're going to start off by flushing this ski. I'll show you guys how I do that with the musket and the, and the PWC flush. So let's get to it. All right, guys. So I got the musket here to flush your ski. It's very simple. Use the quick connect. Oh, oh, that would have been bad. Use the quick connect on the back of your ski. Hit it right in. All right. Right now it's in the off position. You turn, it's gonna get loud. So if you turn the ski on, switch it to the flush, let the, the, the salt run through it. You can see it coming out of the back of the ski. You can see it coming out of the back of the ski, flushing all the salt out of there. Let it run for like a minute. Boom, so that's it. The ski is flushed. I really like how this works. You can see the salt away coming out. You just water to rinse it. You can shut it off in the back of the ski. You don't want to keep the ski running um, with no water going through it. You always want to shut the water off first, then turn the ski off. Now let's wash it. All right, now we're going to wash the ski. I'm going to hit it with some water first. Switch it to the soap and see how it works. One thing I like to do before I can rinse it, let's take a washing mitt. Get all that salt real quick. You know what I'm saying, pal? I'll wash the cooler too. Now we'll rinse it. Also, if you have a sea do or any kind of jet ski and you're washing it, you always get a lot of water in the foot wells.
Last thing we're going to use is the uh, XL boat chamois. Sham wow. Really want to get it wet. It works better when it's wet. And just dry the ski off. All right, and that's it. She's all clean, washed, dried, using the Salty Captain PWC Care Kit. Um, I'm pretty happy with it. I just gotta get more, uh, you know, comfortable using that nozzle. But man, I think it works great. I like how the nozzle works. Um, and yeah, if you wanna buy it, go to saltycaptain.com. Use code NEEK15, save you 15% off your entire order. I think they're having a huge sale right now too. So stack some savings and uh, yeah, one thing, one more thing I'm gonna use, not tonight because I'm running out of daylight, is the ceramic coating spray. That really shines your plastic up real nice, makes it look brand new, so. But I'm gonna end the video here, thanks for watching. If you use this stuff before, let me know what you think in the comments. All the information will be in the description. I'll see you guys in the next one, peace.